Welcome to another edition of Mrs. GTV, brought to you by Mrs. Grissom Salads, Sandwich Spreads, and her brand new salsa. And now here's your host, Mariana. Hello and welcome. Today we are going to make Mrs. G's Tuna Bites, a delicious treat that is perfect for any occasion. I will also share my recipe for one of my favorite Peruvian dipping sauces that will give them an extra kick. And I promise you will love it. I have gathered everything needed, so let's go down the list. Three egg whites beaten until stiff. One and a quarter cup self-rising flour. Half tablespoon cayenne pepper. One and a half teaspoon salt. One and a half tablespoon chives. Half teaspoon paprika. Three quarters cup of cornmeal for rolling. That is optional. Cooking oil and the most important one 11 ounce size of Mrs. G's tuna salad. Now I have the egg whites beaten. Now next slowly fold Mrs. G's tuna salad into egg whites. You have to fold it very slowly. Do not overmix so the air stays in the mixture. When you have it this mixed, you add the flour, little by little, so it maintains the air. Then you add all the other ingredients, the paprika, the cayenne, the chives and the salt. Well, after I mixed everything and is in this consistency, I uh, take one tablespoon and drop it in the cornmeal to make a, a little ball of one and a half inch more or less and I'm going to roll it here take it in my hand and just make a little ball with it you can add a little bit of cornmeal as you need it so it doesn't stick in your hand and then you have it I've been doing some of them as you can see so now we can go to the frying pan and fry them. You can put as many as you want. Let it brown for a little while and then turn it over. As you can see, they are getting brown and nice. You can help yourself with a fork to flip it over and then it's just taking five minutes and it's done. Another way to do it is to skip the cornmeal and the rolling. You just take the mixture and drop it in the pan and as you will see uh, they will brown very easily very fast and as you can see I've been doing some and they come out very brownish and crispy. As you can see, our Mrs. Grissom tuna bites turn out beautifully and are delicious. They can be eaten just as they are or dipped in Mrs. Grissom's salsa. If you have a favorite recipe using Mrs. Grissom's products and would like to have it featured on an episode of Mrs. GTV, just email it to mariana at mrsgrissom.com. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Ciao.